Luke, first off, welcome to Hartlepool United uh, and welcome back to the club. You, you've been here twice before, so just first off, how excited are you to, to be back at the Direct Stadium? Yeah, we look forward to it. Um, something came up quite quickly and I was looking forward to the opportunity and can't wait to get going. Yeah, mentioned there that you have played for the club several times before, so just during them two spells, what can you remember about the club? Uh, the first time, um, I think I was on loan from Burnley, and it was my league debut um, under Ronnie Moore, and that was brilliant, obviously, making my league debut, um, and it was a great experience. Unfortunately, I, mean, I picked up an ankle injury, so it was, it was only a short-term loan, um, but again, really enjoyed it, and it was obviously a good insight. Um, to first team football uh, second time I came in uh, the club was on a high after promotion and I absolutely loved it um, it was brilliant probably one of my favourite times in football um, then a change manager happened and sometimes it works for you sometimes it doesn't and unfortunately it didn't for me so um, I moved on but like the previous times I've been here I've absolutely loved it yeah, now that you have moved on, um, how different of a player do you feel? Have, have you, you know, made progress? Have, have you seen that improvement in yourself? Yeah, probably just maturity, really. Um, obviously, got a bit more experience. Obviously, a bit more know-how. Um, yeah, just just maturity levels, really. Um, I mean, I'm just keen to to get going and and uh, jump him out of the deep end, really, and just um, get the games underway and show what I can do. Yeah, you've played on John Askey before at Shrewsbury Town, I believe. So, just as a manager, you know, how have you found working with him? Yeah, um, it was only a short time because I, I think I went to Grimsby after that. I was just keen to, to go and get games. But um, yeah, really, really good, good guy to start with, and I, I enjoyed working under him, even though it was a, it was a brief spell. Um, and obviously, it's funny how your paths can cross again. Um, and I'm really looking forward to the opportunity. Hopefully, working for him for a long time. Yeah, and what else you know made this move to Hartlepool um, for, for you? You know, what else made it interesting? What else made it seem exciting? Um, I think obviously I, I kind of know the place a little bit, although you know it's come well, quite a different squad. I still know quite a few people. Um, obviously, the same training ground, same obviously same same stadium. Obviously, know know a bit more about the club, um, so I'm not going in blind to it. Um, and hopefully just just get some games on my belt. Um, last year was a frustrating frustrating season for me personally. Um, but yeah, just hopefully now I can put that behind me now and have a really good crack this season with with a good number of games. Yeah, and no doubt you are you know feeling all right, feeling in good condition. Um, you played in pre season as well, so just you, you personally are fit and ready to go now. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I, um, had a good pre season on my belt. Feel really fit. Um, Obviously, every player wants to play, and obviously, when I was at Bradford this season, um, game time was going to be limited, so I wanted to go and try and, and get games on my belt and and get some starts. So yeah, hopefully, I can do that. Yeah, and just for either for the season, you know, for yourself or for the team, have you set any objectives? Um, you know, going into the next few games. I think just take each game as it comes. Obviously. Um, the team started well, which is obviously good. Um, but yeah, just carry it on. Um, obviously, I think there's quite a, a few new players. So obviously, just everyone bedding in together, and yeah, and just giving a good crack with the season, and and, and see what happens really. But just take each game as it comes. Um, obviously, it's a roller coaster of season. So, um, so yeah. Yeah, I don't know if you already know a few of the lads, but you've obviously trained as well. So, how is you know meeting the squad been for the first time? Yeah, good. Yes, yeah. so I've obviously I know quite a few lads from when I was previously here, and then obviously from previous previous clubs as well. Um, so yeah, obviously good lads um, have made me feel welcome so far. Um, training was good, obviously with an eye to the game to, uh, for tomorrow. So, not loads of training today, more just like preparation and a little bit of shape stuff for tomorrow um, but yeah obviously looking forward to just getting my first game out of the way and quickly try and get my feet under the, under the table and and, um, and try and make an impact with, with the squad Yeah you've already played in front of the fans and you know what the atmosphere is like at the Suit Direct but um, you must be you know buzzing to play in front of that again Yeah, yeah um, obviously last time I was here it was on a real high um, and the fans were amazing Um so yeah, obviously we, we obviously need to to put in good performances to get to give them something to shout about. Um, obviously, I know that they're really good fans, and hopefully we can try and get them on our side and and yeah, try and use it as a as a as a tough man, so to speak. Um, and hopefully that can give us some momentum going forward. 
Yeah, and straight into a, a home game against Wealdstone, so it's how much you're looking forward to that one. Yeah, definitely. Just again, like sometimes the best the best way when you join new clubs just to get straight into the thick of it and um hopefully um I can do that and we can and we can get a positive result.